Hi guys, I have a super quick and simple tip for you. If you are like me and you absolutely hate handling raw chicken and raw meat, yuck, 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 this tip is for you. So all you need is a box of cereal, a cardboard paper towel tube, and a cereal container, okay? And it's really easy. Okay, so you're unpacking your groceries. All you do is you take your cereal box, you open it up, and you pull that bag that's in there out. This is the crucial element, okay? Then you take your trusty cereal container and you do what you always do. You just dump your cereal in. Okay, these containers are great. They enable, especially little ones, to pour the cereal a lot better. Um, got a handle back here and everything, but that's another thing. Okay, so then the important thing, you wanna take your bag. Now, the good thing about this is that it's been inside this box, so it hasn't really had an opportunity to get like covered in germs from the outside world. So you're just gonna take it, flatten it out a bit, maybe fold it in half, try not to just handle it too much, and then just roll it up. And you're gonna stick it inside your trusty little tube, which is going to keep it clean until you need to use it. Okay, so I'm gonna pretend that I'm going to be cooking with raw chicken and um, it comes time to handle that bad boy, which I really, 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 really hate. So you pull this out and you pull out, uh, and you can get a lot of these bags in here. This is for storage. So you can pull one out and then all you have to do is stick your hand down in here, pretend I've got some chicken, and see, you can pick up your chicken and you can handle your chicken with this. And then, um, because the side that has the cereal in it is the side that my hand is on, I would much rather get cereal crumbs on my hand than chicken juice. Um, so anyway, you handle your chicken and then you toss the bag. Okay, it's really that simple. Um, I know that some people buy the plastic gloves for handling raw meat. And that's fine. The thing that I like about this though, is that while the plastic bag, yes, does ultimately end up in the landfill, at least I'm getting a, a second use out of it. Um, and so that way I'm adding less plastic to the landfill um, and also saving a little bit of money. So I hope that you try this tip. Um, and if you do, let me know how it goes and keep it easy peasy. Bye.